Akim Abiyoyun and in today's video I'll be showing you the best way to split a column within 30 seconds. So you can use, the, there are actually two ways, though there are a lot of ways you can split a column. You can use it in Excel and you can do it power query. But in today's video I'll be showing you how to use Excel to do it. So you can use text to column to split your column in Excel and you can also use something called flash view. So in today's video I'll be showing you the two ways to split your column within 30 seconds. So right here if you check we have the full name column that contains the first name and the last name. So I will use um, the text to column. I will use flash view to split this column into two. So we want to have the first name separate in one column and the last name in another column. So uh, I'm going to just I'm just going to insert two extra columns here, and the first one will stand for the first name, first name, and the next one will be last name, last name. So now if I want to use flash view, the the best way to do it is you just type in the first name and um, right here you can press ctrl e to just copy it down ctrl e and automatically excel will populate all the first name for you so if you don't want to use ctrl e you can also come here okay let me just leave this and uh, for the last name so i'll just type in k u j a w a Java and uh, I can come here to where I have fill then I can click on flash fill to do that or I can go to the data tab also and also use my flash fill here and another way to do it is you can just type in the first the last name here which is Kujawa so I'll just change this to capital letter K right then i'll come here and type in the first letter of the second last name we start with c and automatically excel will populate all others for me all i just have to do is press enter and i've been able to split this full name into first and last name that is using flash view but now using text column so i will just delete this i'll delete the last name then i will clear this particular um column so this column will be for the last name while this will be for the first name so if i'm using text to column so um, i'll just highlight the first the column b which is the full name then i'll go to data i have my text to column right here so i want to split by delimiter so a delimiter is the um is the thing that used to separate the two data so you can use space, you can use comma, you can use hyphen, you can use slash. Whatever you use to split to separate the two data is your delimiter. You must actually know that. So here you can see we have space as our delimiter. So whenever we want to split, we know that okay, we are using split. We are using space rather to split it. So I'll come to the data tab, then I'll come here to text to column. I'll choose delimited because I want to use delimiter to split. I will click on next then now uh, my delimiter is space so i'll just select space here and if you check down here it has split it for me automatically i have the full and the name right so this will serve as the first name and this will serve as the last name so right here i can click on finish or i can just click on next to select the data type that i want so generally it's always on um, general if you want to use it you can put it on general if you are dealing with date you can change it to date right here and if you don't want to import any column let's say i just need only the full name i don't need the last name i can just turn on this i can check this and say do not import the column so i can say okay do not import this full name or the last name but i want to import the two all i just have to do is click on finish and automatically it's going to split it for me now i have the full name I have the first name and the last name, so all I just have to do is change the header. This we have. This is the first name. This is the first name. Then this will be the last name. This will be the last name. This will be the last name. Now I've been able to split the name into two columns. So thank you for watching that awesome video. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel 
and run as on the bell notification icon so that you get notified whenever we drop awesome video like this i'll see you in the next video i'll see you in the next video thank you and have a wonderful day